Okay. Uh, oh god, that fucking body, the legs. <laughs> Should probably kill the things, honestly. Right, well, I, I killed the ones that were in here, didn't Well, I did kill the ones that were in here. But he followed me through another door. Shit. Alright, go on. Okay. Uh, I don't think I'm going to be picking that up right at this very moment. I think maybe I was too late. B3, oh shit. Here we are. What did I tell you? Fuck. Danger! Danger! No way. Really? What? <laughs> that looks like Rick on the other side. What? Okay. Well, I, I wasn't expecting that. Are you dead? Oh! Seems to be breathing very slowly. Get away from his fucking head. Oh my god. Right, so it's not, it's not over yet. And this still will not move because the generator to supply power to open the door is out. Well, it was bitten, wasn't it, I suppose? Wait, so the power again? That looks fine. But it... Yeah. Yeah, take the good looking one, not the one that's been out of shape. Uh, well, the, only thing I can, <laughs> the only thing I can think of doing, providing everything's charged up, is actually just to take it back where we found it initially, back through here. I guess that's gonna work, right? So if I just slide that back in... Uh, where is it? Startup battery W, that's the one. Uh, okay, so what are we looking for? Red, blue, green and white. Red, blue. Can I just hit C now? I guess so. And then D to put the white one in the slot, and... Well, that's it. Have we got, like, a button to hit, a lever to pull? There's a switch! Yeah. Okay. Huh, alright. Well, this, uh, seems to be working. Maybe it's more reliable than the other power source we were using. Maybe this is less likely to get bitten by a T-Rex. Let's try that shutter again. He hasn't woken up, has he? <laughs> I'll just be very quiet. Okay, yeah. <laughs> if anything's gonna wake him up, the sound of that probably would. Oh man. I'm so sorry. I'm so very sorry. He's been torn apart by the Tyrannosaurus, but more importantly, he's got something. The port card key, right. Cool. That's it then? Yeah, okay. I'm just- <laughs> I'm checking you for plugs and other stuff. Oh shit, look! What's that? D? Oh man, I was hoping that was the other S one. Where's D? Alright, so we're still looking for, uh, two key cards. Torn apart by the Tyrannosaurus, right. Anyone else? Wow. Oh yeah, there is! And that looks like it's been destroyed. So I guess we won't be using that again. There you go! We got- <laughs> I knew there was a plug around here somewhere. Just those three bodies? Okay. Well, we got the- we got the key. So... I probably want to take it back through the DDK door, don't I? <laughs> I don't know why, but I was half expecting him to just be gone. Oh, 
is still running around. And let's see. Tell you what I'm going to do. Turn to the right. Ah! <laughs> it worked! It bloody worked! Alright, fantastic. So the rest station, yeah. Of course, he's still in that corridor. He's not here anymore, is he? Yeah, so I can get through without worrying too much about tripping over legs. <laughs> Think fast. What if he didn't? What if you destroyed that, Regina? I mean, come yes. on. Yes. What is that? I saw something like this in Kirk's personal lab. What? This could be a problem. It's a corridor. This vortex must be the side effect of the third energy experiment. What? There's a vortex? Since when? <laughs> what the fuck? How did you see that? So how are we supposed to get around this thing? Either we find a way or we both end up as dino droppings. Not funny. Okay, I'll pull up any relevant data on the computer. Regina, you search around for any possible clues or leads. Uh-huh, yeah. So you get the easy job again. Right. <laughs> so, hang on, what? What's this? Oh, this is S! Where'd that come from? That was just lying on the ground? Yeah, okay. So I guess I can go back to that room where we can use the key chips and stuff. So there's two two reasons to go back there. Can I use this? Is there is there a thing in front of me? Oh, there is. Yeah, it's dangerous to go further. I'll take your word for it. Maybe if I was running this on Windows 95, I'd see something. I just... <laughs> it's graphically not there for some reason. It's probably a newer version of DirectX or something. I don't know. Okay. So there's a couple of things we can do right now, right? So... There's that laser grid that you dealt with. I can go back to S. I've got the other key chip with a 0392. Alright, yeah, let's go check these areas out. And, uh, no. Yeah, let's keep playing a little bit longer. I want to see how much more I can do. He still hasn't come out. Still hasn't come out to play. Alright. What was around here? Oh. Ah, oh, shit. Is this still locked? I haven't checked in a while. Ah, oh, shit. Oh, fuck! Get up, get up, quick! Through there. Alright, fine. Yeah, so we need to rewrite the ID card before we use the elevator, it looks like. Oh, shit, 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 shit. Yeah, I could run straight on, I suppose. But maybe... Maybe... Oh, yeah, he's up and about, isn't he? Fuck. Ah, uh, slag bullets. Maybe just... One to knock him down. That corridor is really thin. I don't know if I can run through. Come on. Wow. Wow. You... Oh, hang on. Oh, wow. So, hang on. It works there as well. What? Hang on. Um. Before we go in there and deal with what we need to deal with, I'm going to go back up here. I'm going to go see if the other laser grid has been turned off, or can be turned off. Am I running the wrong Yeah, I'm running the wrong way. Because <laughs> beyond that laser grid, there was a door that I think I could open. I guess it's like a level C keycard thing. That's right, there you go. Yeah, it's green now. So... Yeah! Hey! Uh, sure, just in case. What are we going here? Rook up, yeah. Why not, right? That's neat. Yeah. What are we going to find in here, then? Maybe the uh, DDK... Oh! I was going to say DDK door, but... No, it's the code disk for D! 
So that means we've got both, haven't we? Yeah. Brilliant. I just <laughs> I need to find where this door is. Uh, maybe it's on the map. Does it say? Well, this is a big old room. Something over there to my right. Another plug. That's five. Wow. Around here somewhere. What's this? Oh, will I operate the panel? Yeah, sure. No, maybe not. Well... Okay. Uh, looks like, like, again, you're looking for four digits. The only one that I've got is 0392, but I don't know if that's gonna work. Nothing happened. Okay. Hmm. Okay, yeah. Uh, Regina's seen it. I haven't, but... Okay. Let's see. Oh, right, it's another one of those doors, and... Yeah, I was... I think I deserved that, to be honest. <laughs> Alright, well, hopefully there's nothing too important in that room. I'm pretty happy with the plug. Tell you what, though. Let's... Oh, shit. Yeah, use it, use it, use it, use it. Fuck you. You can stay on that side for a while. Um, let's go back into the vent, then. Let's go back to that security room. Round here to the left, that's it. Drop down, and then I should be able to get through... Door S, or shall I deal with the key chips first? I suppose the key chip. So yeah, this way. Hmm. Maybe I should. Maybe I should use the uh, the fingerprint scanner on her, or the body that I almost tripped over. But then I still don't know who they are, like what their numbers would be. Yeah, it's tough. It is tough. So what do we got here? There it is. So that's both of them inside, so... Right! I suppose I will. Uh, is this 0392, I suppose? Yeah, great! Oh, right. Uh, we've done this before. Oh, what the hell? Okay, not quite like this, though. What's this? Oh, I see. So we... Okay, this is maybe a little more confusing than it needs to be. Uh, okay, so the white and the red ones need to be on the right side. And then all the grey ones, all the black ones on the left. I see. Sure. I guess I could maybe just take two of these out. Right, let's go on this side and sort them out as well. So... Doesn't seem like the most efficient way of doing it, because it's not. Still, okay. So I guess I just want to drag these over. I don't suppose it really matters if it's at the top or the bottom, so... Yeah, swap those over. Yep. Oh, okay, so it moves it to the top. As oh, okay. <laughs> no, oh, shit. Let's go back to this one. Maybe. Hmm. To that, yeah. 
there you go. Okay, it took me a while, but it wasn't too difficult. Right. I have taken out the overwritten key chips from the slots. And I... <laughs> Great. Why? What did, what did I do that for, exactly? Data already ri Well, for something, evidently, but I don't know what, precisely. I guess I'll just leave that for now? Anyway, yeah, we've got another DDK door to go through. And then maybe another one beyond that if we find D? Uh, yep, S? Sure. Oh, okay, Saturday? <laughs> Saturday, baby. Uh, okay. This looks like it could be a column thing, so we ignore A and F. S, T, A, B, stable, stabilizer, stabilize, stabilizer, one of those. I, Z, E, R, it is, yeah. Sweet. Nice. Okay. Uh, no. Not yet. <laughs> Just to increase that tension a little bit more. Parts storage. Alright, so let's take a look at the map. Again, fairly big room. Two doors I can't go through. Right. I shouldn't have done that. I'm sterilized. I guess I should be thankful. <laughs> Yay. Okay, let's take a little look, shall we? Uh, Alright. So, no dinosaurs to speak of around here? Wait, was this the door that was locked from the... Yeah, that was locked from the other side. Now it isn't. So, I can get back out to the box, which is quite nice. Can I look through the window? No? Let's go around. Again, I'm going to need this key card. Hold on. Another one. This is D. Yeah, uh, sure. Okay, this is wildly different. G and F. I guess each of these numbers or each of these double digits is probably a letter in the alphabet, so 4 is D. Okay, yeah, give me a sec. <laughs> this might take a little while to figure out. In fact, it might be easier if I just sort of draw out the alphabet and then put numbers underneath each letter. Nothing goes above 26, so yeah, 20 is the last one. So it begins with a D. Fifteen. Where's fifteen? O. I think it's O. Three. That'll be C. That's easy enough. So that was fifteen. So. Uh, I believe it's T. Docked. We're going back to O again. It's Doc. Doctor. I think is eighteen. Yep. Okay. Doctor F. Oh wait, no, 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 ignore F, because maybe we're ignoring the key this time. We're ignoring G and F. Okay. <laughs> this doesn't seem like a very good password, but I'm pretty sure it's Dr. Kirk. <laughs> Just in one long word. Uh, yeah. Fuck's sake, man. <laughs> Improve your passwords. <laughs> I mean, what's the point in having the, you know, the input disk and the code disk? It's that simple. Okay, what's the deal with this? A slot to insert a key chip, the number... Oh, okay. Uh, maybe this is why I did it. <laughs> At this point, I'm honestly not sure. Um, where is it gonna be? There you go. Really? Or is it two? Why is it two? Oh, the... 
Maybe that one up ahead is for one. Same thing? Yeah. Right, just to get through the extra layers of security. Okay. Another an eight, that's okay. This looks like it's the place to be, you know? Fairly well hidden away, got a lot of security. Oh wow, right. Rick, I've located the main generator of the third energy. Great. See if you can activate it. <sighs> yeah, I'm sure that's easy as hell. <laughs> Uh, okay, is that, wait, is that a door over there? It is, and it looks like it's locked. And there's another one across from me. Okay, well let's see. What's up with it? Locked from the other side. Sure. Wow, yeah, where do I even begin? Maybe this, uh, blinking light? I don't, yeah, maybe. <laughs> Alright. I like it. I like it a lot. I suppose if you're going to be an evil scientist, you need to have a lair to go along with it, don't you? Not that he's a completely evil scientist. I think he's just sort of misplaced his uh, efforts in a way. The panel that activates the third energy... Right, okay. Against my better judgement, yes! I should have saved. I really should have saved. Error. Preparation procedure incomplete. Okay. Hmm. Fair enough. Uh, what do we got around here? A red blinking light. That's never a good thing. <laughs> yeah. Nothing happened, of course. Certain preparations have to be made before pushing the switch. Fair enough. What about this screen here? Nope. And no. Okay. Uh, I guess I'll come back when that's flashing green instead. Let's keep exploring. There was an another door, wasn't there? So. The control room, right, yeah, this might be a good place to get started. Lack of dinosaurs around this area, I kind of like it. I suppose, if nothing else, the passwords are sort of dinosaur proof. <laughs> and what's this? Sub display for the terminal that controls the generator. How delightful. Ah, I still need to get this better ID card, don't I? got here. A file title is... Oh, the instruction manual! Right, for once I'm actually going to read this. What do I need to do? So, prepare to activate the generator by operating the main panel on the upper floor of the control room, which is where we are right now, yeah? Move to the B3 area of the generator to set an initializer. Operate the panel near the initializer to connect the inhale shaft to the generator. Move to the B2 area to set a stabilizer. 5. Activate the generator. Number six, go back to the control room and adjust the output on the lower floor. When activating the generator, make sure the doctor is present to avoid accidents. The generator cannot be activated without Dr. Kirk's I So we need that before we get started. We need his ID card. Okay. Oh, is there something up here? Mm-hmm. It's... <laughs> Another one! We've got six? We've got six plugs. That's crazy. Nice view you got here. Bulletproof glass. Liquid crystal. Can't see through it. It's... Oh, it's smoke mode. Okay. <laughs> I wonder if that was like a graphical limitation they just sort of wrote around. Wait, there's another panel over here? Man, I, I don't want to get too involved with this, to be honest. Right, hang on. You mentioned like a lower floor. That's down here, then? I think maybe I'll just sort of sightsee for the meantime, and then maybe save. That seems like a good bet, because I think if I do something wrong here, I could obliterate the entire island. I mean, that note from earlier? Man, uh... Yeah. Can this be moved? Yes. Yes, it can. <laughs> Let me guess. An anode or a plug? An intensifier, okay. That's kind of cool, actually. 
That's a good one. Oh boy, another journal. Yeah, I'll read the file, why not? Since I was assigned to this department, all I've done is sample the simulation data of the generator. Even a college student could handle these tasks. Why doesn't Kirk want us to operate the generator? Doesn't he trust our ability and skill? To O. I don't think the problem is so simple, because his ID card is required to operate the generator. Once an accident occurs, Kirk is the only person who can stop it. I don't see what the military is planning to do with this conniving, nonsensical procedure. I have an idea. It's about that guy Tom who was recently assigned to the B1 area. He often comes to me to ask about our job. I guess he can't resist my charming personality. Why don't we invite him to our group and have him spy on Dr. Kirk? This should work, as he is good at gaining the confidence of other people. Don't be so simple-minded. Have you already forgotten how you've been trying to get Kirk's attention until recently? Learn to think a bit more logically first. At any rate, the male researchers here don't seem to know much of anything beyond research. Maybe you ought to try showing the next one you become friends with, or close friends with, the wonders of shampoo and the washing machine. You cheeky fucker, see. <laughs> oh, look at this, another one. What? What is that? Level B. I haven't even seen any level B doors. I've seen A and C. Well, let's check them out. Oh. That's the... Wait, hang on, is that also... Right, that sort of elevator shaft? I guess I can access that. Maybe I should. Yeah, maybe I should. Anything else? It looks like we're kind of done, at least around this lower section. There was like another room though, right? And I think the door was open. Or it seemed open on the map. Through here? Yeah. Power frequency? <laughs> oh my goodness. I think a lot of this is going to go over my head. More map? Oh, is that Kirk? Yeah, record the map. Well, I don't think that's Kirk, actually, but... Okay. Anything else? Uh, okay. That goes around to a, a corridor. It looks like it's blocked or something, maybe. Locked up somehow. She's unconscious. She's dying. Oof. Oh, man. I wish I had some med packs. <sighs> or a recovery aid or something like that. And what's this? Circuit schematics to display the status of the emergency power supply. Currently it's set to the basic power source of the facility. Okay. Can I? Yes? Oh, fuck. Oh, it's another one of these. Oh, goodness me. Okay. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, I suppose we're going to have to do that at some point, so... Uh... That might... No, that's not going to do it either. Damn, alright. I'll well, tell you what, I might actually come back to this later on. I still want to keep exploring, and I don't know if I want to do this right now, because I don't really know what I'm doing. Yeah. Kirk has been hiding everything from the researchers recently. In a demonstration of solidarity, the B1 Lab area staff have decided to investigate what Kirk and the military personnel are up to. Okay. As a start, we managed to set a wiretapping device at the parts storage area where they've been holding the meetings. Uh, the device is sound activated and records automatically. It can also play back the recordings. It may be the best way to come up with some clues. We need Kirk's ID card to check the generator. We already know his registration number. Hey, 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 78814. So, 78814. Eight one four. And that's the reg number, right? We're going to actually need to sort of forge his card, then, I suppose. Does that mean we also need his fingerprint data too? Maybe. Well, I need to find him, don't I? Okay. Uh, all we need now is to. Yeah. Okay. I should have read the last bit before I asked that question, but yeah, we need his fingerprint data too. <sighs> okay. A uh, couple more boxes. Let's, I suppose, see what's in the red one. Just two? Ah, oh, I've got plenty more, so yeah. Heat bullets for the grenade gun, alright. Slag bullets, yeah, this is all good. This is all really good. Uh, 
Maybe let's just put away these for the slag bullets. And then let's sort it out. There you go. Should have an extra slot now. Maybe I should take out some more grenade bullets. Actually, I definitely should. So that can go there. Again, I'll sort it using this. There you go. And then maybe heat bullets too. Or the intensifier. Or maybe I'll just leave that there and, and deal with something a bit later on. I'll take the heat bullets for now anyway. Just lines and lines of machinery. And a locked door. Uh, no, locked from the other side again, unfortunately. Yeah, alright. Well, okay. There's that puzzle I can get on with. I just need to tinker around with that. I think I was actually on the right lines. Just, just fucked it up a little bit. So, with that key card that I found, this works? Yep. So that, I think, is going to take me back to where we use the port key, yeah? Yes. And there's probably going to be a dinosaur waiting for me. Let's see. No? Nothing. Okay, yeah, I'm, uh, I think I'm going to take this opportunity to just go in here and save, and then next time, I suppose we're going to have to go back up to that area, and we're going to have to turn the power on and follow those instructions. And yeah, it's going to be a lot of work. But uh, yeah, I'll save that for another video. Thank you very much for watching. See you next time. I think maybe I was too late. What did I tell you? Let's see. Tell you what I'm going to do. Turn to the right. Ah! <laughs> it worked! It bloody worked! Think fast. What if he didn't? What if you destroyed that? I saw something like this in Kirk's personal lab. What? This could be a problem. It's a corridor. Wow. Wow. You... Oh, hang on. Oh, wow. I have taken out the overwritten key chips from the slots. And I... <laughs> Great. Why? What did, what did I do that for, exactly? I shouldn't have done that. Uh, yeah. Fuck's sake, man. <laughs> Improve your passwords. Against my better judgement, yes. It's... <laughs> Another one! We've got six? We've got six plugs, that's crazy!